All right, so I wanted to show you an example of using a loop. So I want to display the average of a list of numbers entered by a user. So we're gonna decide that these are going to be, uh, let's say, doubles. So I got my double um, sum, and I have a, a double, or maybe uh, let's make an integer, int count. All right, and it says to stop when the user enters zero and display the result. So I'm gonna go ahead and do a loop here. So I'm gonna do, do while loop. So I'm gonna do, um, do, I'm going to prompt the users, or maybe I'm just gonna print something first here. SCD, C out, I'm going to tell them to type numbers one at a time, enter zero to stop. Okay. All right. Now, in my do while loop, so what I want to do is. First of all, I'm going to read in a number here. And so if the number is um, zero, I want to not do anything. But if it is, well, not zero, I want to add it. Okay. So I'll do STD, CN, and put the number into my, well, new number. So I got double num all right so we'll put it into num all right now i once i've read the number in i want to check it so if num equals zero then well if i guess this is not equal to zero if it's not equal to zero then i want to do something well what i want to do i want to increment increment my count so I do count plus plus so the total number of numbers I've read in is one more and I want to add it to my sum so I'll do sum plus equals my number and then at the end of the do while loop so I'll do while num is not equal to zero all right so what this will do is it'll prompt the user to type in numbers and then they'll just start typing in numbers and then it'll just keep adding them up. And when it's done, it will, whenever they type in a zero, it'll break out. So let's go ahead and run this. It's not going to display anything yet, but run the code and make sure it works. So I type in a one, two, zero, and it breaks out. So it's breaking out with zero. So that's good. Now I want to display the results display results so what are the results well we want to display our average so let's go ahead and make another average we don't really need to do it but we'll do it anyway double average all right so the average equals the sum divided by the count there is one little issue here. What happens if they don't enter any numbers except for zero? Well, in that case, we have to do something to, well, figure out what to do. So maybe we'll initialize average as zero. And we'll say if count is greater than zero then we will do this average calculation. Otherwise the average will just stay zero. We'll say, well, it's zero. All right. Okay, then I can do my print statement here. STD, C out. And I will say the average of the, I don't even tell it how many numbers there were. Um, count. 
numbers was average. And we'll do an end L. All right, so let's go ahead and run this. So I type in one, two, three, zero. It says the average of three numbers was two. That sounds right. Let's go ahead and run this again. And I'll type in zero. And it says the average of zero numbers was zero. I'll go ahead and run it again. And we'll do some larger numbers. And it says it's this. So you can see it's scientific notation. But either way, this should show you how to calculate averages of a bunch of numbers. You just do a do while loop, prompt them in there, or read them in, and then process them and decide what to do with them. And then when you're done, you can display the results.